Let's talk about accepting credit cards from your customers and how to account for them in your Peachtree software. Let's demonstrate this by coming into the receipts window and let's open one of our customers, Cunningham Construction. Let's say that Mr. Cunningham came in and he's going to pay his balance with his Visa card. So for reference, let's go ahead and put in Visa card and let's come to, down here and let's pay the balance. 176.58. Click on the credit card button here. In this window, we want to first check the cardholder name information and billing address information. This is the information must agree with where the credit card statement is billed to. Over here, the receipt date and receipt amount carries over from the previous screen. In this field, we can put in the credit card number, expiration date, and the three-digit verification number. Now, the next thing we do is authorization. If we're using the Peachtree credit card service, at this point, we can click on the authorization button. And the Peachtree credit card service will then authorize this credit card and update our Peachtree system accordingly, including an authorization code right here. Now, depending on your internet connection, such as if you're on a dial-up connection, this process can take about 20 seconds if you're already connected to the internet. If you're using a, a different credit card merchant service, such as a swipe terminal, you'll want to swipe the card and then manually enter the authorization code here. Once you've done that, just simply click on OK, and that's going to bring us back to the screen, and then click on Save. And that's how you accept credit card payments within your Peachtree software.